It's been quite some time since we have been hearing rumors of Nikon releasing a new full-frame camera module. And, it's likely to be called the Nikon Z8. As per the rumors the upcoming Z8 is likely to give a tough competition to the current one of the best Sony A7R4, with a similar 61 megapixel camera sensor. The camera is also expected to feature a new high res mode for detailed pictures and higher dynamic range. Well, the features doesn't end here. Let's find out more about the Nikon Z8 based on the leaks and rumors. First, let's talk about the sensor that Nikon might use for their upcoming camera. According to the digital camera world, Nikon is likely to use the same 35mm full-frame back illuminated CMOS sensor, same as the A7R4. And, this new XMR R CMOS sensor packs a lot to make your pictures even more amazing. Being back illuminated, you are likely to get a higher sensitivity, lower noise, and the sharpest possible pictures, all in 61 megapixel. The new sensor will also ensure excellent night shots, no matter what the lighting condition is. So, for those who love taking shots of sunset or night times, the Nikon Z8 will be a great option for them. Nevertheless, the improvements will not only be the 61 megapixel sensor, the ISO range and stabilization is also likely to be an upgrade for this Nikon flagship. For the ISO range, the Nikon Z8 is rumored to have an ISO range from 64 to 25,600, which can be pushed to 32 to 102,400. Huge, right? So, you will have plenty of options to choose your suitable ISO range. Moreover, the Z8 might feature dual CF Express memory card slots, to store all your high-res photos. Talking about high-res, the upcoming camera is expected to have a new high-res mode, that will allow you to snap pictures at astonishing 240 megapixel resolution. If that truly happens, Sony will certainly be in trouble. However, one problem that might appear is, with all these upgrades, the Nikon Z8 will surely produce a massive amount of heat. Ultimately, this will hamper the overall performance of the camera. So, Nikon needs to be very concerned about this fact, and find a proper solution so that consumers can get the most out of the Z8. As for the launch, based on what Nikamera suggested, we might see two variants of the Nikon Z8, one being 45 megapixel, and the other 61 megapixel. What more upgrades would you love to see with the upcoming Nikon Z8? Throw all your thoughts in the comments. Give this video a thumbs up, and subscribe to our channel to keep yourself updated with all the latest tech news.